Piper, are you ready? So, we're packed up, sort of. <laughs> um, Piper getting a treat already? Yes. Maybe she gets a treat. Uh, here. This seems like a genuine ripoff. Wait, hold on, look at it. The dog gets a treat. Good boy. I'm at potty. <laughs> we are headed up on the Washington side of Hood River, Oregon, which is white salmon. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go there, a little campground called Gorge Base yeah. Camp. It used to be called Bridge RV yeah. or something like that, so they changed names, so I'm still getting used to it, yep. but um, yeah. So let's go check that out. It's an easy drive, it's in like an hour from here, so it's a nice easy drive. Yeah. Um, let's go get set up. Do you and... notice somebody's not here? I know, it's just two of us, well three of us, it's the dog. So no Taylor this weekend. But... She she wanted to stay home, uh, school started, and she wanted to stay home and go to the football game, and um, she's gonna have a friend over. So here we go, let's go to Gorge Base Camp. Base, RV Park. RV Park. Yeah. White Salmon, Washington. Yeah, it'll be fun. Let's hit it. All right. Welcome to Gorge Base Camp, White Salmon, Washington, just down from Bingen. Um, here's a couple things, really quick observations. We haven't really walked around yet, but just quick observations. So you can sort of see it over there. That is Highway 14. So it's loud, um, at least where we're at. This is not a very big campsite, but it's pretty loud here. That's kind of a negative. Um, but like I said, we haven't walked around yet, so I don't really have much to say. But the cool thing is, Pretty nice view. We got a pull through spot number 29 here. So here's our rig. It's a, it's a cool, it's not a bad spot. I mean, it's, it's what we like about this is we're close to home. It took us an hour and five minutes to get here. So it's a cl close drive up the gorge, just across the bridge. I mean, you can almost see the bridge from here is Hood River. We'll drive over there tomorrow, go walk around. But this is Gorge Base Camp in White Salmon, Washington. So we've done a short walk around. We will chalk this up to, we've been here. So there's a little, uh, what's the 76 gas station right next door? Um, it's questionable. Yeah, we were asked we'll, for money. Asked for money outside from a guy, from a guy in his car. Van. Yep. So that was fun. Um, but it's an experience. But, and it's, it's, not, it's not a great one. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a great experience. It's a little loud, like I said before. Um, but you know, if you have these spots up here, they back up. They're the farthest. They're the farthest, farthest from the road, and they kind of back up to this down here. So they got a little bit of a view, which is a little bit better. The downside, right on the other side of these bushes, not right on the other side, but another 30 feet down there, are the train tracks. So we've only heard one train so far. We knew. We knew about the train. I knew that. So it's it's a li little loud. So, I mean. Not a bad sleep last night. Uh, it was a little loud, but we used a white noise app, Calm, so that helped. So it wasn't too bad. I only heard the train a couple times, but overall we slept pretty good. Had the dog sleep in bed with us. That was awesome. Um, but today we're gonna head over to Hood River, drive across the bridge, go walk along the waterfront. Not too breezy today, so I doubt we'll see any kite surfers or wind surfers or anything like that but we're gonna go walk along there, check it out. We'll take you guys along with us. Gonna bring the dog. Should be a fun day of walking around Hood River and checking it out, and we'll be uh, happy to show that to all you folks who've never been to Hood River, Oregon. It's really pretty up here.
so gorge dog. The gorge dog in Hood River on the main on the main street where all the shops and stuff are. I wanted to get. I wanted to talk to him about. Okay, I can't. They probably can't hear me. Either. Stop. And then mom got a. Oh, she likes it. It's fine dog fanny pack oh my gosh i am so excited for this this it's is a, to put the it's treats a treat in. it's a treat fanny pack so dog haul it's a dog haul well, dog because, fanny pack because i've been putting treats in my pocket and forgetting that they're in there and washing and anyway but let's let's talk about the best thing we got okay so <laughs> that's kind of scary <laughs> so this is i mean we got some cool stuff but hands down we got sasquatch She's probably gonna hate it. Watch her whine, like whimper. Where's the squeaky? There it is. Do you like Sasquatch? Do you like Sasquatch? All right, so now let's drive down to the waterfront and see what's going on down there. Um, and I think a little bit later, my brother's gonna join us. So that could my be fun. Yeah, brother and sister-in-law. Yeah, so that's gonna be fun. So yeah. let's get down they're, to the water and gonna, go check it out. Gonna... Welcome to Camp 1805 in Hood River. So this is cool. Check this out. Um, they have these little, uh, these are called cabins. So they're kind of cool. So you can see some that way and some this way. And then this is our view sitting here. And we're kind of enclosed in too, which is really cool. So it's, um, we're... I think the reason why is because Hood River uh, is known for the wind. Um, they yeah, it keeps the wind out. Yeah, it's yeah, one of the awesome. top places for windsurfing. Yeah, we'll walk out of the water sorry. a little bit. Kite surfing. Kite surfing, windsurfing. Um, it's all the same. Kite, you need to win to kite surf. You need to win to windsurf. You done? And you need a husband to be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we got some food. We got uh, some nachos, cheese plate, a flight, and a drink. And let's share those in a little while when they come. We share them now. It doesn't make sense. You said that in our last video recording. So we got a flight. So here's the flight. So we have vodka, rum, and then barrel rum and then some whiskey these are all distilled here so these four are done here at uh, camp 1805 and then Christine got this is called a David Bowie so Mount Hood Serrano pepper vodka passion fruit and lime um, Serrano pepper infused vodka yep so let's give these so, a whirl see what we think wow that's amazing vodka We just got food. And here, we got a cheese plate. Nachos. Pork nachos. Yes. I'm trying. Come check out Camp 1805. You guys are in Hood River. Yeah. Highly recommend. 21 and over. 21 and over. That's a downside. Not kid friendly. But it's also a plus side. It's not kid friendly. <laughs> it, it can be, yeah. But it is dog but friendly. But honestly, their menu is not. It, it's it's like heavy snack food. All Hood River it. here, dog friendly. Super awesome. There's dogs everywhere, so it's great. Anyway, Camp 1805, Hood River, like I said, come check it out. And open container law, so walk around yes, the river and, um, and we'll walk around later. In fact, we'll show it you. Just, we'll walk around be... with our drinks and show you. Yeah. But again. It just has to be capped. All right, so Hood River Park we'll area, walk, walk around. Um, yeah, gonna... This is cool. Check this out, man. Christine's head. <laughs> come on, Piper. Go walk down to the water.
The GoPro's pretty sweet. Yeah. Hi, Olivia. <laughs> this is my uh, niece, Olivia. Senior in high school, she's gonna get into filming slash photography, right? Yes. And so she's so shy. She's a behind the camera person, but she is a Dodger fan, so we like her. Uh, so anyway, so this is my cousin Olivia. My brother and family came up and met us, and we're out here in Hood River enjoying windsurfers and enjoying a nice day. They're gonna come back, hang out with us at our campsite, and hopefully Olivia opens up and isn't so damn shy, Olivia. Come on, monkey, let's go. Overall, not a bad weekend. Um, well, brother... what's nice, actually kind of what's nice is that we couldn't get the place for a third night into Monday for Labor Day, but I'm actually kind of glad because it's a beautiful weekend and we still have another day at home. Yep. So yeah. thanks for joining us again this week, guys. Thanks for checking us out. And a special shout out thanks to my brother and his family, my uh, sister-in-law staff. And my niece and nephew, Olivia and Trevor. Thanks, guys, for coming to hang out with us for the day. We had a blast. That made the weekend. So that was the best part of our weekend, it for was. sure, was hanging out with my, my, my family. So thanks, guys. Glad you came. Love you guys lots. We'll see you guys next time somewhere down the road.